Hello, hello, it's Brandy Janae. Thank you guys so much for tuning into my channel today. In today's video, I'm going to be setting up my Hobonichi cousin for the week of February 20th through the 26th using this super cute kit from Cactus Paper Company. I just really like the colors. Like I think it's very pretty. And I wanted to go ahead and use it so, oh, and then I found this washi. It's some like older washi that I have. I don't even know where I got it from, but it was in the stash and I just thought the whole like plant vibe would go together. So I am not going to be using this page right now because I won't need this until I start doing the actual weekly plans. Oh, also laundry's going, so yeah my life is life in right now um and then i'm going to use these full boxes when i do the daily pages the icons will be used later on as well i might actually go ahead and use this weekend banner though i think i'm going to do that anyway so let's go ahead and lay down the base oh here they are tweezers so hello everyone i hope you're doing well um, thank you again so much for helping me to reach my 20K goal. I know that I've said that already, but I'm still incredibly appreciative of each and every one of you that made it a success. Oh, you know what? I want to use, I think I want to use these instead. Let me see. Oh, nope, those are too big. Are these, these are probably also too big. Ugh. Okay, let me do some. I'm gonna have to do a little bit of sticker surgery. All right, so step one. <laughs> Let's go ahead and cut these down a bit and I don't know apparently I, I don't know I got my thumb I just noticed that it's like it's not bleeding but I must have picked at it too hard at some point I don't even remember doing that um and I'm just kind of guessing how much needs to be cut off so this may not be perfect but it should work. Normally I actually take the time to like measure, <laughs> but I have other stuff that I need to get done today. So I just want to get this done quickly. <clears throat> I had planned on doing it later, but then I'm like, you're going to start doing stuff. Cause it's a day off today. Today is actually the 20th. So I'm like, and it's president's day. So I am home. So I'm like, you know how it is. I'm going to start doing something. And then next thing you know, it's going to be nighttime and I'm not going to feel like doing it. So I figured I would just go ahead and get this done before my day even started. So that when my day does start, I can just, just go. <laughs> All right. So that worked out much better. So yeah, anyway, I am definitely going to enjoy this day off. After I finish filming, I am going to go to the gym. And speaking of gym, I started going back last week, I think last Thursday. So that was the what, 16th. I started going back on the 16th because I used to go all the time and then you know, that C word came. And so I stopped going, obviously. And um, I just like canceled my membership and I hadn't been going for like a really long time. And I honestly was just using that as an excuse afterwards <laughs> because I'm like, you know, obviously I didn't stop going anywhere else. So I could have gone back to the gym. But like I said, I was using it as an excuse for a long time. And so I just decided recently, like, okay, no, for real, like, you need to 
get yourself back into the gym. And so, because I've just been like stressed, y'all, like stressed, stressed, stressed. And I'm like, this is the best. For me, going to the gym is the best stress reliever. And so, yeah, so I started going back Thursday. I did take Sunday off just because um, I do, you know, suffer from like a lot of injury and I'm a very injury prone person. <laughs> so I took Sunday off just to kind of give my body some recuperation time. So, but I'm definitely looking forward to going back today. So, but because of that, I was watching, um, uh, YouTube channel and now because I'm talking about it I can't think of what the channel is but I will try to remember to put it in the comments but I was watching the YouTube channel and this girl she was on like a weight loss journey journey and she did like a basically like in her cash envelopes she set it up so that if she lost a pound she had to give, um, like she was doing a YouTube giveaway. So if she lost a pound, she got to put the money in her folder to do something special with. But then if she gained a pound, she had to put it in the YouTube envelope to do as part of her giveaway. And so anyway, I was like, oh, well, that sounds like a great idea. And I don't really have like a ton of weight that I need to use lose rather because I've already done that but I have picked up a few pounds that I would like to put back down so um it's definitely something that I have been thinking of so I'm trying to figure out like how I want to kind of modify that for myself my goal right now is to work out at least four days a week um like you know, that's my goal. And eventually, you know, I'd like to be able to do, you know, five to six days a week and just have the one day off. But right now, like my goal is for four days a week. So I'm thinking that I might do a combination of like, if I, you know, actually do my four days of workouts for the week, then I can put money in my envelope. And then if I don't, I could put it in the YouTube envelope in conjunction with, you know, if I lose a pound or if I gain a pound or whatever. Um, so I'm kind of thinking about like combining both of those two things in to one. So we'll see. You'll have to watch my budgeting videos because that's typically where I talk about that kind of stuff. But I did just want to put it out there that it's something that I am, in fact, considering doing. So um for my sidebar, I typically put, I think I'm going to use this little book because it's cute. I do put some deco on the side. That's crooked. So yeah, I usually put at least one deco box. And I'm hoping that my head is not in frame because my hair is all over the place. And then I... That's cute. And then I kind of want to put another one of these washi strips just because I think they're pretty. And this is still very crooked, friends. But I don't want to keep picking that sticker up. So it's just going to have to be crooked. All right. And then I'm going to use this sticker here oh i should have used the bows oh well i'm gonna use this sticker here as like my highlight of the week and then oh now i'll use a bow just because i think they're so cute and we'll stick this here and then does this have the one time i want to use habit trackers <laughs> The kit does not have them. So I will just use these as habit trackers. Like I'll just write on them. And I've been tracking um, my no spin. 
And okay, so my no spin is different than most no spins because my no spins is no spin on planner related items, not no spinning in general. Um, because spinning in general is not <laughs> necessarily where I have the problem. It's the planner things that I have the biggest issue with budgeting. So yeah, my no spin is literally just for planner related items. So if you hear me talking about that in a budget video and then you're like, bro, you just bought like a new shirt and some new shoes and new, that's not, that's not really where I have the problem. It's, it's definitely the planners. Um, one moment, cause my washing machine is clowning. All right, hopefully that's a little bit better. It is very loud because the, it is very old, so. Boom, boom. All right, so I'm going to put this washi here at the bottom. And I love this washi. Like, I think it is so, so pretty. But it is very old. So hopefully it will stick. This is not the right side. Okay, can't get that to work. Moving on. All right, that's good. Oops. Perfect. And we will start you here. So, um, I guess by the time you see this, it'll obviously be after President's Day. But does anybody like do anything fun for President's Day? Like, what do people do? I mean, I just usually enjoy the day off. Ideally, I would have taken this long weekend to like go somewhere, but. I had a lot of stuff going on this weekend. So, I mean, really, even if I wanted to go somewhere, I wouldn't have been able to go anywhere. Um, but then I also know that I will be doing a lot of traveling and stuff in the next few weekends. And then, of course, I'm like getting ready for my birthday. So, I'm like a lot of money. <laughs> a lot of money is being spent right now on just lots of different things so you know even if I wanted to go do some traveling I'm not doing that right now so I'll put this back here in my little washi graveyard as I like to call it all right so that is super pretty I love the way that turned out and then the only other thing I think I'm going to add is this weekend sticker because I think it's super cute. And, oh no! How did that even happen? The sticker must have like already been ripped. <sighs> Whatever, it is what it is. Okay, so that is done. Moving on to here all right february 20th i'm gonna use this one and i have definitely gone to the maybe i'll use the journal page maybe i won't philosophy and it has been working out very nicely like i feel much better about it so if something happened on a particular day that i felt like was worth you know journaling about then i did it but 
you know journaling extra about because obviously i put it in the other part like as the memory part but yeah if i felt like it was worth journaling extra about then i did it but then if i like if it was just a regular old day then i didn't worry about it all i did was just wrote the scripture for the day and i'm really happy with that like i am here for that all right so we're gonna put monday Because I didn't pull out any numbers, I'm not going to worry about it. Um, so yeah, it, it has been, like I feel a lot, it feels a lot less redundant to me. However, <laughs> speaking of redundant, I did decide to start using my pocket size planner again and so i printed this insert from etsy uh the shop is annie plans printables which is where i used to always get my pocket printables basically because she just has so many of them and they're amazing so i'm gonna flip this around so yeah i ordered a printable from her shop and then put them back in my wallet now this is why I have realized that when I'm carrying my, especially like tote bags, you guys, they are just so heavy. Having a wallet in there with like cash now that I, you know, am still getting used to having because I've always just used a card. So having a wallet that's full of cash envelopes and then having a planner and then a pen bag, a pencil bag rather. And then like, it's just, it's a lot. And so... I'm like, dude, like I'm killing my shoulders. <laughs> I can't, I can't keep carrying all of these things. So I decided to just put some inserts in my pocket, uh, in my wallet, because that's essentially what my wallet is, is a pocket size planner cover from Motown. So I put my planner, oh, wait, I should save this one for Wednesday. Sorry, I put some inserts into there and I'm just going to combine those two for my carry on carry planner. So it does actually work out, though, because in that one, I probably won't use like any stickers like it's legit just going to be pen and paper. So um, it'll work out. And then it's nice because I can just keep a couple weeks in at a time and then, you know, take them out. So I will be using my Hobonichi cousin um, and it'll stay like open to the week on my desk. So then in the mornings, I'm trying to just develop a better like planner routine. So in the mornings, my plan is to get up, come to my desk, check to see what I have to do just so I can have like you know, an idea of what's happening for the day. Um, write out any additional things that, you know, I may have found out about or may have scheduled. And then just literally transfer those things over to my pocket so that I have it with me on the go. Um, so that that's the plan. So yes, <laughs> although I just had that big issue with being redundant, for right now, I'm going to have to be because that's just going to be the best for my shoulder. Real talk, just the best for my shoulder because it's been a lot trying to carry. And then again, if I want to carry a smaller bag, um, I don't take my planner with me because it won't fit in smaller bags. And so now I don't have to worry about that. Like my planner will fit because my wallet fits in any bag that I carry so there is that so anyway yay for decision making guys this is so crooked I don't know why I'm having such a hard time today with laying down things I don't know. I'm used to, I'm trying to, like I said in 100 videos, I'm still trying to embrace this whole natural light thing because I'm always like super jealous when I see people's videos with the natural light that I don't, in fact, have <laughs> natural light. And so now 
that I've readjusted my life so that I can have a desk in front of a window. Now I'm like, I can't see. I don't know how y'all see with this natural light. Because <laughs> I'm so used to the artificial light. So I'm like, whoo, child. These uh, almost 40-year-old eyes or something else. Okay, that's better. I just love the foiling on these. It's just so pretty. And it's like a copper like a gold copper color it's just really 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 pretty um i'm happy i didn't get rid of this washi when i did my d-stash video um oh and also hop on over to my budgeting channel because or but not budgeting channel it's the same channel my budget video because i am also doing a giveaway so you don't want to miss that um, but yeah, I'm doing a 1k subscriber giveaway, but that information is in my budget video. So I will try to remember to link that in the cards. Uh, did I put Thursday up there? Sure did not. Thursday. All right. Friday. It's nice having these ready, even if, like I said, if I don't write anything except for the scripture, it's still nice having them decorated and pretty. Because, I mean, really, what's a planner if it's not beautiful? <laughs> it's a cell phone. So, okay. So, Wednesday, Thursday. Oops. Let's go back to Friday and Saturday. So yesterday, which was Sunday, my friend Lena, who is a um, newly establishing photographer, she basically talked me into doing. She didn't have to. She didn't have to work that hard, to be perfectly honest with you. But she talked me into doing some pictures for my fortieth birthday. And you guys, she sent me one of them yesterday just as like a teaser. And it is gorgeous. Like so beautiful, in fact, that I decided to post about it in my community posting or whatever here on YouTube. So if you didn't see it, go check it out because it is gorgeous. And if you are in the St. Louis metropolitan area, and you would like to have someone just take like, you know, portraits of you or your family or whatever, minus the studio, minus the, you know, just some real life, beautiful photos. I highly recommend my friend like, and I'm not just saying that because she's my friend because yeah, my friends know. <laughs> uh, just because you're my friend doesn't mean I'm going to shout you out if you're not, you know, if you're not doing good quality things. Like, I'm, I'm just not that kind of person. So, now I will, because I am their friend, will help them to, you know, be a good quality service provider and then shout them out. But being my friend does not get you an automatic uh, green light <laughs> to... Um, you know, to get me to recommend people to you because I'm like, uh-uh, that's my, uh, I don't want to say my reputation because I'm not, you know, whatever, but that's, that's still, it's like my name. Like I don't, I don't put my name on things that I don't agree with. I don't put my, you know, I, I just don't like, I'm one of those people that, you know, if it's not something that I actually believe on that I don't promote it, I don't, um, you know, talk about it. I don't advertise. I don't do any of those things because at the end of the day, like, you know, whatever I attach myself to, I want it to be good. Like, I don't want it to be harmful or hateful or hurtful or, you know, I don't, I don't want it, anything to, to be that way. Um, cause I'm like, 
I, I just, well, I guess I just don't. Like, that's it. I don't. I don't really have any reasons other than I just don't. Um, I like to promote things that are positive and good for mental well-being or health or whatever. And even if I'm not the epitome of any of those things, I still like to promote good <laughs> over, you know, bad. So poor quality to me, not even poor quality, poor service, especially customer service is huge for me. Like I cannot even tell you how many companies that I have stopped uh, buying from or working with or whatever, just because of, you know, a poor customer service experience. Um, and I'm like, you know, to me, like Chick-fil-A is the standard. Like <laughs> if you're not giving me Chick-fil-A service and quality, like I'm not, I'm not interested. And again, is it perfect? Absolutely not because we're human. Um, everybody's human. But you know, if I come to you as an owner and I don't care if you're small or big, um, if I come to you as an owner with a, a concern or complaint and I feel like my voice isn't even heard, um, then I'm, I'm done. Like, I don't, I, what's the point? <laughs> like our relationship is severed. So that's just me. That's just who I am. And so I don't, um, you know, I don't, I don't give my money, especially to things that I don't, um, believe in or agree with. So she, I said all that to say, <laughs> Lena is a wonderful person like she truly 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 is a wonderful person and both of us have extreme issues when it comes to confidence and you know just believing in our ability to do all the things um and so I think that we both although she did it for me I think we both at that particular time needed that confidence booster you know we obviously needed it for different reasons in that moment but we both definitely needed and needed it and so it was just like really really great because she's a boss like she is a boss at taking pictures but she doesn't see it yet you know what I mean it's like she she's dope and so yesterday I feel like she really got to see like, no, for real. Like, I am really good at this, you know? <laughs> um, so it was just, it was just really awesome. It was a really awesome experience for both of us. And I am like super, super grateful to just have some amazing women, especially in my life. Um, I got some dope male friends as well. Um, but the women in my life are just incredible. And if you're a woman watching this video, if you know, you know, we, whew, women friends, having women friends, maintaining women friendships is rough. So I'm grateful for, I'm truly, truly, truly grateful for my squad. Um, but anyway, now that I have all talked to you guys to death, I'm done. So Sunday, Saturday, Friday, here's Thursday, Wednesday, Monday, and Tuesday. And then going back, oops, to my weekly pages. I, I don't know why I don't like put a bookmark here. All right. And then we have the week set up and that is it. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Um, I will, of course, be adding to this once I get into the um, day by day planning. Um, so, but yeah, I appreciate you guys for tuning in with me today. Sorry, this video was rambly. I have a lot of stuff to talk about. Um, but thank you nevertheless for sticking here, sticking in with me. If you made it all the way to this point, leave me a plant emoji in the comments, just so I know that you made it this far. I'm still working on watch hours, um, to reach the next level of like monetization. So I would truly appreciate you for, you know, just watching till the end. Um, I think I said another video, even if you have to step away for a moment, just let it play until, um, the end of the video, because it does truly help my channel, um, tremendously. So thank you. Be well, be safe, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.